So what are the stages of meditation? What happens when we sit down and close our eyes and try to focus? What actually happens? I think a good way to describe this is to draw it, which is why I'm using this paint stream. So let's say we sit down and we ask ourselves, what is in my mind? And what we see is just this blank piece of paper. There's nothing there. It's rather boring, or maybe it's a bit chaotic. A bunch of random thoughts, feelings, memories. And the more you sit, the busier it gets until finally you just call it quits. So what is the purpose of meditation that we think meditation is supposed to be? What are we taught? What, are, what do we assume is supposed to happen? Well, we think that if we do it right, it becomes less. And if we do it for 20 years, then finally there's just one thing remaining. And that's the I, in quotes. And then if we're lucky and it turns out that we are a Buddha, then finally there will be nothing and we're done. And then this is enlightenment. Check mark. We did it. But is this really what we're trying to strive for? The reason that I'm using this paint stream here is because the way that we think about what is in our minds in a visual way is very helpful for understanding what it is we're doing when we meditate. We all have a model of what this is supposed to look like. And the model that I just made is what I imagine most people generally have. But there are other ways to think about this. There are other ways to visualize this. And if we visualize this in a different way, our practice might be different. So what if, instead of trying to reduce all these dots, you take a closer look? Well, instead of trying to make them all go away, let's zoom in. We pay more attention. So there's the same number of dots, but now it turns out they're not dots. There, there's, there's structure here. Each one of these has a unique shape. Instead of trying to eliminate them angrily and obsessively, let's try to actually understand what each of these are. Let's look at this one. Let's zoom up on it. So now we have zoomed up on a specific thought, a specific feeling, a distraction in our minds. And now we realize it's not just a simple dot. It's not even just a simple shape. There's actually, there's a tremendous amount going on here. It has some external structure. It has some internal structure. There are things going on. Maybe there's even like movement. Maybe the entire, th maybe all of it's moving. Maybe it's getting bigger. Maybe it's shrinking. Maybe it's actually, maybe it's hot or maybe it's cold. Maybe there's color in this. Maybe there's color around it. Okay, so instead of we're doing now we're doing the exact opposite of getting rid of these dots. We're actually embellishing it. Or not we're not inventing anything. We're we're trying to see what it's actually made up out of. And there's always something there. And it's always a bit of a mess, but it's always very interesting. You have shape, color, movement. Maybe it even has something like personality. Maybe it's angry. 
or very happy. So now we're personifying what we initially thought was a distraction. And now we're well on our way. 